G'day everyone. It's the Revenge of the Sith Republic gunship full of Utapau troopers. I've had a lot of fun setting this up. I hope you enjoy looking at it. It's probably One of the better scenes I've done with a Republic gunship. I've got uh, 24 souls on board. Yeah. There's six airborne troopers inside on the drop off platform. I'm going to give you a look at that in just a second. I'll just give you a little bit of a close-up look first. I like this view from behind. So let's just have a quick count. So we've got uh, one right up the back. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven Utapai and Cody. So that's eight on that side. Got another right up the back. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And the heavy gunner, that's what I'm calling him. Could be an ATRT driver, but he's my heavy gunner. So that's 16. Two pilots, 18, and six airborne, 24 troops. Yeah, that's the most I've ever got on board. It doesn't look great. So let's do this drop off. Take a look at the airborne troopers. around the back of the ship is the release. So, so the grip with your left hand, I guess, would be the way. Come down, land, release. There we go. Let's have a look at this airborne. Scene in Revenge of the Sith. So you can barely even see him inside. But yeah, I really squeezed the most time I think I can. So anyway, let me put them back into the ship. See if this all falls down like a house of cards because um, it can be difficult putting it back in. But uh, I've done it once or twice, so I should be right. 
Look from underneath. Lift this right up so you can get a good view. And put the front part in first. Yep. Push up the back gently. And there you go. We're back inside. This is why I originally got the ship, was for the Ujapais scene. They could have gone a lot longer. I'm sure George had a massive scene in mind, but it was sort of all cut down. done a, a lot of different troopers in my gunships but yeah first time I got this on video really pleased with how it's turned out let me try and get some of those great views I've been looking at See those airborns. Yeah. You can see them. Some uh, handheld lighting. Let me just grab that. Just to dark. Oh, yeah. See if I can put some light onto this object. That's better, eh? So without the light, <laughs> you can barely see. I'll just put that down so I can steady the camera. Side as well. So that airborne is better. Take the zoom off for a sec. I think it's better with the extra lights. Turn the detail a bit better with the camera. It's a nice view that, isn't it?
Yeah. It's gonna be a while till I take these out, I'm telling you. <laughs> because it just looks too good. It's gonna be on display for a bit. But I've got my other um, Republic gunship to play around with. And I'm gonna be um, putting those new art troopers in it, I think. Next. Pretty certain. Um, what else could I show you? Bit of icing on the cake. Those airborne troopers are pretty good, eh? I've got a uh, ultra elite squad of airborne troopers. <laughs> How cool are they? Yeah, I got a few plans for more Utapai, Utapau uh, scenes. Uh, a quick look at <laughs> so, uh, Cody. That's um, uh, I think maybe around 2010, something like that. That card came out. That's from 2006, I think. That Cody. He came with. Uh, silver base and I think that's Darth Sidious hologram. So yeah, I've got um, quite a few General Grievouses at my disposal and Obi Wan's. And um, yeah, I'm just about to break out some droids. I think it's going to be the perfect storm. I'll probably get some of these troops down and give you a closer look at them in the upcoming video but, um, I'm gonna be keeping it like this for a while That's the one I had. I've got. It's Revenge of the Sith, and that's the 2006 stuff. And this was after that, obviously. I hope you've really enjoyed this video. I really enjoyed getting it all together to show you. And I'm looking forward to doing more Uta Power stuff and Revenge of the Sith stuff 
person. Until my next Star Wars collection video, may the force be with you.